I see here, we've got a drain back solar system here that's been working for 30 years. We're replacing a water heater. There's the water heater. It's got a 60 gallon tank. It's so good. We've got a pump that pumps water up to the roof, comes back down through the heat exchanger, goes into the tank. Thermal siphons into this tank. The tank comes on when it's cooled. I'll show you the panels. It's a high Sierra tank designed here in Grass Valley. Um, like I said, it's been working for over 26 years. There's the panels up on the roof. Um, like I said, it's a drain back system, so the water does not stay in the system. The controller turns the pump on, water pumps up to the to the collectors. As soon as the controller says I don't have any more heat, turns the pump off, the water drains back into the tank. The tank is atmospheric, it has no pressure, it has no glycol. There's a heat exchanger inside the tank that exchanges the heat from the solar hot water and pumps it or, or puts it into the water heater. The solar the solar collector will then thermal siphon and exchange water through the, the vat of hot water so that the only time the electricity is used is when that tank gets cool, turns electricity on. Anyway, cool design that I'd share. Bye.